what's going on guys welcome back uh thank you so much for uh joining appreciate you stopping by checking out this video now it's been a really really long time since i've uh, posted anything on youtube but it's not that i've uh, stopped collecting it's just i did slow down a little bit i just really haven't had the time to post anything but you know i'm gonna keep on going at this uh definitely enjoying this and, and everything is well anyways i'll just I did, I am just mostly collecting the Atomic Limited Vintage now, so um, I did, uh, I removed them from the boxes, I don't, I, I have the boxes stored somewhere, but I just wanted to get a quick video out here before uh, anything, I figured if I get this ball rolling, um, then I'll, uh, I'll be able to produce more videos, or not produce, but you know, just make more videos here and there, um, as I would like to, so check this one out right here. This is the uh, one of the newest Atomic Limited Vintage. This is the, what do we call this? The Evo, let's say down there. Yep, the uh, four, is that right? Mitsubishi Lancer, there it is. Uh, 186 LVN, 164 scale, Atomic Limited Vintage. You got a nice uh, pattern on the wheels. Dread, uh, looks good, the exhaust, sweet. The beautiful blue color. I wish I had the box with me. I mean, yeah, the box is somewhere stored. Um, but yeah, it, the interior looks fantastic. It's just super clear plastic for the windows. Uh, you can see right through them. Perfectly fine. You see the bucket seats, I guess. The uh, red detail on them. Side view mirrors are already installed on this one. That's a that's a that's a bonus. You got the inserts for the tail lights and the headlights. The yellowed out blinkers to the side. You got the, I guess those are the fog lights down there, right here. Super sweet car. This is a great model. Uh, this the wheels look awesome. So I'll just like zoom in a little bit on this. And uh, this. Just a really nice model. And if you're wondering, this this mat right here, this is like a mouse pad. Um, it's made by Mini GT. But there's a lot of people making them out like nowadays, so you shouldn't have any trouble finding them. Just look them up on eBay or something. But this is a really nice, beautiful car. I think this is really... Like, you got the... So we can zoom in a little bit more. There, right? You got the. Oops, I don't want to scratch that. Uh, right there, sweet. Got that one right there too. So. Awesome, right? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Uh, I think this is a great model. I'll um, I'll cut this video short. I do have a lot of Atomic and Limited Vintage that I would like to show on this channel that I'm going to continue to do so. And uh, I'm just not going to show them. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to show them out of the box because I, I don't have, I don't store them in the boxes. I usually, I get these uh, little tea bags. I, I think I got this from a, a long time ago from another diecast collector on YouTube. He he posted how he, anyways, the yeah, tea bag, you get a Ziploc and also very important, one of these uh, dry and dry thingies to make sure that you keep the moisture out. That way you don't get any issues with the... Well, I, I live in a very dry place, so I don't think there's a lot of humidity, humidity where I live. But, uh, you know, gotta keep them safe. Anyways, thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate it, and I hope you guys can tune in for another, another one soon. And uh, peace.